Good evening. I'm going to be doing a... I don't know if it's going to be that long a session. I'm, I, I want to try and break the sessions up a bit. Look, there we are we are sinking our teeth into Liza P. So the sessions are going to get longer. But the editing is nuts. In about 10 days, Lords of the Fallen drops. And we're going to have to try and juggle both. <laughs> yeah, there's no way I'm going to be able to do recording, editing, and then work as well. It's just, it's just not going to happen. So I'm going to make sure before then, we've... I've got a... a you know, a bit of a, a backlog to kind of like, backlog's not the right word. Got a bit of like a pool of videos to pull from. So that's the plan. Yeah. So at least when Lords of the Fallen drops. Why does that seem a bit fucked up here? Mm. <coughs> anyway, point is, I'm hoping it's decent, but we'll see. Anyway, let's jump in. Whoa, what was that lag, sis? Saw something pop up on the taskbar. That's where we came in. Where am I going? Mm, I will be monitoring this machine closely. If it starts messing about, I'm gonna go out and restart. Hey, yo, I wonder if I can wear my glasses, man. Ironically, I've got glasses that look similar to Vanini's. <laughs> Does it reflect, though? That's the thing, I don't know. Like a biki, I need to see. It's just it's my glasses are fucking way bigger than Vanini's though, bro. Eh, that's not bad. All right. Huh. Also, cut some of the brightness off, man. Of these fucking lights. Jesus. I dipped them in like oil beforehand. There we go. Into the mines. Oh yeah, and we have the, where am I going? This way. And we have the fire grindstone as well. Ooh. Do not just jump down there, Nick. Get yourself killed, bro. Oh yeah, fire barrels. No, that thing's dead. Okay, so we did all of this. No point in doing it again. <coughs> Goodbye. No. Oh wait, don't they have like quite a mad persist? Oh god. Ooh. That was a bit quicker than I anticipated. Well, that was unnecessary. Oh, but look at that health bar, bro. <laughs> yeah, yeah. These dudes can take more punishment, though. So we're going to have to put into motivity. Oh, we probably should upgrade the... Do I have an upgrade for the weapon? I don't think so, bro. It's not moonstones anymore. Or at least, I think it's like a fuller moonstone or something. Ah. Oh. Well, that sucks. Did he see me? Or was he just patrolling? No, he's just patrolling. Cool. Oh, this should work. Yay! Oh, that didn't. Ooh. Kid Moonstone. I think. Oh, hello, Roxy Pants. Hello. What you been doing? What you been doing? Hey. You've just been chilling. You've been chilling. Man, I hope we can upgrade the health soon. I mean, it's all, you know, well and good having a nice big, like, health bar, but it takes, like, two vials to, you know, fill. Oh, 
Thermite. Oh, of course. Should have actually checked for these dudes first. What the? Hey, man. Why? Okay, uh, now I'm stuck. Why did the remote die? Does it run out of battery? No, man. <laughs> That's really annoying, dude. Anyway. How do I... I, I Hold on. Can I check? It's really difficult to see if your if your controller's got juice on when you're playing on PC. Oh, battery level full. So why the hell did it turn off, bro? What is running on my machine now, man? Anti malware. Oh, do you really need to do a, a, a fucking virus scan now? Yes, sis, bro. Why? Why the why the need? Sheesh. I'm not sure if that's what killed my remote. I don't think so. This looks like a glitch. Okay, let's not hit the fire barrels. Okay. No, 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 Camera! Okay, then this fool's gonna run towards the fire barrel. <laughs> that was a twofer. Thanks. Okay, now we're gonna go. We're gonna go topside first this time. Get that mupper throwing the grenade. There you are, you bastard. Ooh, that's gonna be a bit tricky though. No, no, no! Ah! Oh. <laughs> All the developers are laughing at that fact. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cheap, cheap, cheap tricks. Hey, mother, bro. <laughs> Those grenade oaks need to die, bro. <laughs> Wow. Have some health, bro. Jesus. Oh. Big pipe wrench. <laughs> I saw that in the demo. Hello, Rox. Uh, hmm. Not on my pants. Good grief. Now, did I see a what's his name? A checkpoint. Am I losing my mind? I'm losing my mind. 
It wasn't. Ooh, whoops. Oh, no! Oh, God, it's one of those annoying assholes. Uh, what I saw was this. Dark Moon, Moonstone of the Coven. I think that is the next upgrade for my blade. Ooh. However, I just saw that big pipe wrench, and I absolutely want to check that out. Hello. The problem with these oaks, dude, is that they look at this, dude. Look how much look how much they hit you with. And you do no damage to them, bro. You do no damage to these fucking oaks. Alright. Let's just have a look at this. Assemble weapons. There we go. Pipe wrench. It's beam motivity. Ooh yeah. Wait, what's the damage? 117 and my blade is hundred and what? That's not possible. Oh, there we go. So my current blade is 144 physical attack. Oh my goodness, this thing is more straight off the bat. It's going to be a completely different weapon though, but that's okay. Let's see what it's like. Oh my word, it's awesome. <laughs> oh, oh, it's slow though. Damn, it's very slow. All right, let's give it a bash. How's the parry? Okay, the parry doesn't look too slow. Let's try it. Let's try it for a while. I mean, the fact that it's more than my blade means we don't have to upgrade it for a bit. Oh, but it's so slow. <laughs> Did it break his weapon immediately? Oh. Okay, so the problem with this, obviously, because it's big, is it takes up a lot of stamina, man. And we need a certain amount of stamina after the attacks, so we can actually do a parry. Hmm. Okay. But let's try it for a bit, man. Oh, it hits like a truck. <laughs> Damn, it hits hard. Hmm. Okay, we can try it for a bit. The other option would be, of course, to put that on the blade handle. We could do that. Or the blade on this handle. Oof. Oh god, we gotta deal with this crap again. Um, so many of these fools. I'm gonna try something quick. Not sure if it's gonna work, but it might be a bit risky. Oh shit! Okay, it's alright, it's alright. Okay, no, that's not working at all. Shit. 
<laughs> yeah, you see, so we ran out of stamina today. So... Ooh! Hold the phone. Ooh! Okay, does it need a charge? Oh, it does. How much do we need to... It needs to be a full, full whack, eh? Hmm, if we, if we time that right... And we still have parry after. Hmm. We need to know that the whatever is attacking us is, uh, you know. Hmm. What I'm also noticing is the guard regain is golden with this with this weapon. I think it's just because it hits so hard, so you get all your health back. It's definitely a... Definitely a payoff for that, eh? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I got all my health back in one swing. Hmm. Cool. No, 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 no! Oh, whew! Dude! No, 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 no! Alright. <laughs> yes. Pain in the ass. Okay, now against the... What's his name? Against that mini-boss? Oh, I don't know how that's going to go. You had no chance. <laughs> okay, well. Cheeky, I thought. Ooh. The nice thing is, dude, like, it breaks their weapons almost instantly. It's pretty great. Let's see if we can kill this fool. Come, you annoying idiot. Can we make it in time? Yes, we can. Ah, oh, shit. No, 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 no. Come on, dude. Look at this. Right. Okay. Got that shit. Um, yeah, I think I'm just going to skip this dude, eh? For now. I'd like to... I'd like to see if there's a... There is. Great. Um... See what's up here. Bodies. Could they be from Moonlight Town? Oh, did Puppet 
Let's see if I can activate this. I'm tired of I'm tired of going back to the beginning. It's you know it gets old, bro. See that shit. Look at that shit. And you can't get out of it. You just you just get stuck. No, bro. This pipe weapon, bro. I know it's like it's very risk reward, but damn, the rewards are good, dude. <laughs> no, 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 no. Fuck off. Carrier's amulet. Oh, I think that does the what's his name? No, it does. Oh, no wonder I'm moving slower because this weapon is so much heavier. Shit. Carrier's amulet. Okay, so that puts me back on light. Oh, I wonder if if you're running heavy, does that mean you use more stamina? Just doing like basic actions and shit. Hmm. I think it might. All right. Let's see. Yes. <laughs> Look, this weapon still uses an enormous amount of stamina. So, you know, for the next couple of upgrades, we're going to have to, um, dude, dude, dude. Fuck, oh, that's annoying. For the next couple of upgrades, we're going to have to, um, ooh, sure. This is a cool looking area, though. But yeah, the next couple of upgrades, we're going to have to focus on um, stamina and... Oh, that's a bit risky, Biscuits. How do we get there, bro? Is that... Do we have to... Oh, okay. I think we have to run and jump. <laughs> cool. <laughs> okay, no, no, no. We don't. We're good. Oh, but we can go down there, though. And then cross there, and then up there, and then... That's a way to get around. Wait a minute, do we have to go across that, like, creaky old bridge? No, oh, bro, I'm going down this way. <laughs> Let's not go down the death trap bridge. Dude, there are a lot of fire barrels, bro. I'm gonna see... Oh, butterfly, 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 butterfly. Where the hell was it? Oh, no. Did we activate it? I don't think we did. I don't think we did. I saw Jiminy light up red, though. Oh, yeah, all right. Oh, oh. Okay, what I want to do is I want to just use, I want to just try this for a bit, because um, this is our original handle, it's what we're kind of used to. You know, and we know the moveset and uh, it's less of a stamina drain. However, I do want to go back to using the, um, the longer handle, I like that moveset. Okay, where is the butterfly? Must be down here. There it is. Cool. Crescent Moonstone. That's the upgrade. Oh my god. There's another one. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let's not hit the... Oh no. 
done it the... Ah, <laughs> shit. Oh, well, I killed it. <laughs> Another Crescent Moonstone. Okay. Awesome. Uh, those are the upgrades after the Hidden Moonstone. Nick, where are you going? It's fine. Moonlight Town Guide. Ooh. Moonlight Town is the lowest place in the city where pilgrims prepare for their journey. Since Saint Frangelico met the one-winged angel and found the church, Moonlight Town has become known as the place where pilgrims are lifted to the cathedral by pulley and prepare for their pilgrimage. Andreas's reputation was at its peak when he was appointed as priest. Andreas. At the time, Kraut was only a poor, common, uh, poor country town, but Andreas didn't mind and devoted himself to taking care of the people. They were even saying that Saint Frangelico himself had returned. Moonlight Town actively helped the priests, goods, the priests' good deeds and always acted together as colleagues who deliver the word of God. The decision to accept alchemists from outside and receive Krat and revive Krat was made in the Moonlight Town. After all, it was the birthplace of Krat we know today. Today we have the cable railway instead of the pulleys and the city of the future instead of a country village. But our virtues remain unchanged. Just like how the angel wraps in Frangelico in his wings when he fell into the cold people should help each other the place lower than any other moonlight town is proof that that virtue is still here hmm i'm enjoying the lore of this game bro and you're not like it's not too much this is because you can get a bit hectic okay well that's this little bottom area done Neat. I'm not gonna lie, I I much prefer the the heavy what's his name. It's no break! I knew it would break. I knew it. That's why they put this other way there. <laughs> Bastards. Um yeah, I definitely prefer the the longer handle, but we need a bit more stamina. Um, and we're going to have to pump into what's his name Ooch. come on oh, we're going to have to uh, pump into what's his name into carrying capacity because I would like to have another amulet you know yeah I saw you bro no, 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 come on. Oh. Well. Look at these oaks, bro. You bastards. Oh, come on, man. Dude, the fucking interrupts are so ridiculous. Look at that, dude. <sighs> that was ridiculous. Hello. It was absolutely ridiculous. But yeah, my thinking is to, um... Is to definitely... Or five snakes. Yeah, hit that dude. Wait a minute, it doesn't look like it doesn't look like they have friendly fire. Hey man. That's no Rue. No, they don't. No, that's not okay, Rue. You gotta have you what you gotta have like they gotta hurt each other. It's bullshit. Ugh, oh, that's annoying, man. You know what I mean? Like, if the oak is throwing a fucking grenade, you can't decide who gets blown up by it. It's a grenade. <laughs> yes, sis. <sighs> Yo. No. Anyway. 
Um, yeah, I'm definitely, I'm loving this, um, I'm loving this wrench, dude. This wrench is amazing. It is a lot slower, of course. Getting used to the timing of that is gonna, it's gonna take a minute, but, yeah. It's cool. I decided to go back to the other one. I think we might as well learn now. God damn, it hits so hard. It's awesome. It's just super slow. But look at that! Dude, it just, it just, yeah. <laughs> this goes through enemies. Yeah, it's fine. All our upgrades will just go into health, ugh, our health, stamina, and um, and carrying capacity for now. I'd like to be able to. We have, I mean, we have a, we have a, our health bar is huge. I'd like to see what it is, what it's like without the amulet. What the hell was that? Oh, I'm just enough of these oaks with the goddamn forks. Um, did you not see that I was blocking? Did you just forget? Oh god. <laughs> Who makes these games, bro? <laughs> it's like... Let's frustrate the person until they hang themselves. <laughs> Fuck sakes, dude. Look at this, dude. Remote's off again. Uh, why does it do this? I don't know what is going on with this disconnecting remote, bro. It is. And it's happening at the absolute worst time. It feels like I'm being trolled by the fucking universe right now. <laughs> what the fuck is going on? Oh god, of course, bro. <laughs> Jesus, dude. <sighs> this fucking game. Ah, so that was the noise. Okay, so they want to just absolutely murder. Ooh. Okay. Can't move. Can't move. Can't move. Can't move. Okay. Done. There must be something amazing in this box if this is what you have to go through to get it it's a converter fire damage goes down physical damage reduction rate goes up acid damage reduction rate oh uh. <laughs> that makes me think the, uh, the upcoming boss is uh, an acid boss great all right well Oh, it's a tree. Dude, I thought like someone was just standing there. Huh. What is going on with my nose tonight? It's so itchy. Uh, that's a stalker. Hello. 
Okay, you don't want to murder me. Cool. Do you want to go up, child? I'm sorry, but the train isn't in service anymore. The cathedral isn't the sanctuary it once was. The people who went up there never returned. I still don't know what happened, but I do know this. The cathedral is off limits forever. If you're determined to pass, you must prove your identity. Who are you? Are you a stalker? Uh, give the stalkers greeting. Interesting. I thought all the stalkers died when the workshop tower collapsed. Who? <laughs> as for me, I'm as good as dead. A sinner who lost everyone I ever loved. I have no right to stop someone as determined as you. Please be safe up there. Wow. I was lucky. <laughs> then she was just like, you know, I'm one of the other ones. What is this? Bastards and? It's bastards and sweepers. Here we go. <clears throat> Ladies and gentlemen, oh, no. welcome aboard the Pilgrim's Cable Railway. It's the lunatic. Now, those of you who joined us in Moonlight Town, we hope your preparations for the Pilgrim's journey are well underway. Fascinating town, Moonlight, just fascinating. Back in the day, the only way to reach the cathedral was using a rope and pulley. <laughs> so, so just read. thanks for building it on a cliff, Saint Frangelico. I kid, I kid, Frangelico. Wonderful saint, wonderful. Anyway, next stop, the Bridge of Atonement. While you atone there, don't miss a magnificent view of the beautiful crot. <laughs> It's been my pleasure, friends, and enjoy the rest of your journey. I've been your captain on this ride, Gemini! Well, not bad, huh? Oh, I really am good at this. When in doubt, let Gemini be your guide. <laughs> you, uh, you look annoyed. what I do? Ah, I'm sure it's fine. Let's get a move on, pal. <sighs> The Riddler is a Gemini. Right, it's the same voice. So it's a Menard's lamp that's gone nuts. Wow. Dude, there's so many references to like AI and like Terminator and <laughs> something's off. Do you see that over there? I recognize dead puppets, that's to be expected, but what is that? Dude, I don't know what you're looking at. You're freaking me out. Okay, well, whatever it is, path of misery. Oh, gosh. Okay, we've activated the stargazer. What is what? Oh, uh, what is that? Oh, it's a zombie. <laughs> Great. So, like, even Menard's lamp has gone berserk. And yeah, I suppose you've got good ones and bad ones. And Gemini happens to be this Gemini, anyway. Gemini Cricket happens to be a good one. Okay. Oh. Uh. Oh god, okay. Oh, no idea what those things are, pal. Approach with caution. So this is now the new type of enemy. Oh, it's super fast. Yeah, it's a zombie. Jesus. Okay, that's... So that was what we saw. Look how sift this thing looks. Gross. This is what we saw when we... Um, what episode was it? It would have been the first one. Where it looked like Davy Jones' locker where that dude was like becoming part of the environment. 
I don't know if it's like part of the plague or whatever, but essentially these are like the walking dead. Ah, move. Okay, well. Carcasses are weak to fire. That means their bodily fluid is... Can you always leave the things up just a little bit longer, bro? That means their bodily fluid is also flammable. Oh, well... Ooh. Okay, so what's interesting is... Yeah, look at that. I'm getting it like a Last of Us fire, bro. Oh, that's... Suff. So it looks like there's a slight blind spot just before they attack. Which means we can get around them. Look, this is just the minions. I mean, uh, you know, there's going to be... Oh, God. There's going to be, like, zombie bosses and shit. Whew. Well, we've completed the mines. Should I make this one episode and then make this another episode? Maybe. Oh. Dead. Oh. Yeah. Okay, so as long as you can, as long as you can get that little window, and hopefully that window doesn't become ridiculously tight, Benini's urgent repair tool, um, then yeah, these guys aren't too bad. Again, it's the minions. You know? Oh god, they hit stupid hard, bro. Alright, you need to die. And if they're that sensitive to fire... Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> They're really quick. Okay. Uh, oops. I want to try something. Or should we just push on? We'll just push on. Fuck it. Oh no. 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 There we go. Okay, we'll push on to the next stargazer. But what I want to do is I want to put the salamander... Because that, that's... it's a fire weapon, like, regardless, right? So what I want to do is I want to equip the salamander. I don't know if I pull it, put it on this handle. Although I might. What is happening? What's their problem? Wait, wait, their bodies are strangely altered. I don't know what's going on, but keep those eyes of yours open. Cessus, bro, don't you worry. Oh, just relax, bro, just relax. Oh, no. Shit. It's going to be very difficult when there's more than one of them. <laughs> very. Yeah. Okay, there we go. Ooh. 
Oof. <sighs> okay. Um, yeah, my thinking is to... Hey, man, we also had that fire axe. The wrench could also go on that. Oh, no, but that was technique. Never mind. Woman's prayer. God, I pray with all my heart, please withdraw my wrath from Krat. She's a poet and she didn't even know it. Pray. Who are exhausted and injured? I don't think he can. Wait. It's a gesture. Bro, there's some Darth Vader breathing going on. Sit, swagger, fear, show, show off clothes. Stalker's promise, sit. We need a gesture of prayer. This breathing is not like a room. It's in my ear as well. Uh oh. Oh no. Don't be a one way entrance. Okay, we're at the cathedral. So the puppets and the zombies are killing one another. Well, you guys can have that. Have a good time. I want to go to this other route. As I can't stand leaving things undiscovered. So good, bro. I thought you were from the organization. Uh, never mind. My name is Janjo. I'm an alch uh, a pharmacist. Alchemist. Yes, pharmacist. <laughs> I'm looking for the legendary gold coin fruit. I was able to use medicine to slow the infection spread. I have the petrification disease and I need a cure. Sorry, I ramble when I'm nervous. Read this. It'll explain things faster than I can. Many substances can be poisonous. The precise dose is what separates medicine from poison. Huh. The gold coin fruit might just be a myth, but in the midst of an epidemic, it might be our salvation. C can you let me know if you find it? Sure. I'll give you this by way of payment. A cube. There are various kinds of wish stones which can be equipped to, equipped to cubes. Using cubes consumes wish stones. You can equip a wish stone to a cube or replenish it through Giangio or a stargazer. The people of ancient Krat knew how to bottle a wish upon a star. They claimed special powers. After distilling the wish into a cube made from a meteorite, huh. I don't know how it works, but it's said to react to someone who has ergo and grant them power. Awesome. If you can help me with the gold coin tree, I'll give you more of this. Deal. Seems there's a new threat every day, friend. And no safe place in the world. No place to just take a breath. I'm headed to the St. Frangelico Cathedral. Perhaps find some peace there. Uh... If you find the gold coin tree, please find me there. I recommend not going there just now, Rube. Okay. Temporarily restores HP. That imbues the cube with a special effect. A mystical, a mystical crystal embedded with the wish of the star. When used, it can display a special effect. A mountain bag, one of one. A mountain storage, nothing. The people of ancient Krat 
Knew how to bottle a wish. Water, 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 water. Okay. All right. How do I get the gesture? I know that statue needs a needs a uh, what's his name? Is a gesture. How do I equip this, bro? Right. I oh, fixed all that jazz. Okay, so we still don't have any form of prayer. I really want to know what this does. Well, since we don't need pulse cells, we might as well try it. I'm hoping it can we can it replenishes at a at a what's his name? And not like it doesn't Yeah, I don't know. I hope it's not a scenario where we have to like farm shit. Cause I, <laughs> I get over farming stuff, bro. Like it's okay like now and again, but if you gotta constantly do it, I'm just gonna, I'm just not gonna use it. If it's something that it's a once-off use, but replenishes every time you go to a stargazer, well, that's a different story. Then it's, then it's a scenario of planning it for, like, a boss fight. Okay, so we are now at an hour and a half. I think we should stop at the entrance of the cathedral. Well, they killed all the puppets. Wait, where's the next star? Where's the stargazer? Oh, I think it's miles away. We have no health. <laughs> no, let's stop here. It's fine. All right, I have an idea. We'll go back to the hotel. Yeah. Okay, so what we'll do, use Stargazer. All right. Now it makes sense to switch to the fire firearm. And then we just need to decide what we're going to do with the weapon. I'm loving this weapon though. Okay, before do we, we do anything, we're going to have a quick chat. Hello. I know my way around. Hi. Okay, so that requires hidden moonstones. This requires nothing. What? Ah. So this requires a crescent moonstone, two of one. 171, dude, yeah. Okay, I'm taking this to level three. I mean, we have enough. Okay, so now we need a crescent moonstone to make this level four, but we've just made this a level three and we're doing 214 damage. Fantastic. <laughs> Uh, we can put a motivity crank and go from B to A and pump this up even more. Whew. Like I'm super keen to, we only have one though. You know what? No, it's all good. We've just, we've just upgraded the hell out of it. It's fine. Well, we, what I am going to do though is I'm um, quickly, You're hello. Changing somehow. Huh? That is how you are unique. You can go beyond a puppet's limits. I don't even know if Geppetto is aware of this. Learn huh. from how humans behave, how they feel, even lie if you must. Those lies may change you, may rewrite reality. Lies are a weapon used by humans who thrive in a world of deception. Okay. No, 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 no. We need stamina and capacity. And we're going to keep doing those for a little while. My plan is to do, keep them like an hour, hour and a bit, and then do more of them. Kind of vibe. I don't know. That's, I'm still toying with how things are going to work. But that's my thinking. Anyway, hope you enjoyed the episode. And, uh, and yeah, I'll see you, I'll see you in the next one. Bye.